robot detected. Welcome robot test subject to the Aperture Science Redacted. for the classifying of word deleted. You will not be told the purpose of your test today. We will not be told why you are performing them. To preserve the integrity of this triple blind study, no one involved will have any idea why anyone is doing anything. For the purpose of this classified exercise, your barbed meat stripping claws have been replaced with hands. Please raise your hands up to your neck mounted weapons platform, which for the purpose of this exercise has been replaced with a face. Good. Please exit the elevator. Exit the elevator through the open elevator doors. Exit the elevator through the only available opening that you could possibly exit from. This opening good. You are now ready to begin the hand-assisted non-verbal machine human communication training. Please approach the training platform. Please approach the platform. Good. Deploying first exercise. Hello, I am Frank, a friendly human. I like you, so I am waving to you. To consummate this wave exchange, raise your hand, open it, then swing it gently from side to side. That is waving. It means you like me, like I like you, which I am demonstrating by waving. Good! We are now bonded in eternal friendship. Good. Deploying next exercise. I'm going to shake my fist, this fist, at you. And there's not a thing you're going to do about it. Shake, 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 shake. You don't get to... Oh, now you went and did it, didn't you? Well, guess what, pork chop? Just when you think you got the answers, I change the questions. Double shake, double shake, double shake, double shake. Shake, 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 shake. Good. Deploying next exercise. Hello, it is me again, Friendly Frank, who you murdered after I only wanted to be your friend. I clawed my way out of that pit of despair with a singular purpose, to come face to face with you once more and finally exact more friendship. Now, give me five. Give me five. Five representing the forefingers and one thumb on your dominant hand. Flattened out and thrust forcibly, but non-threateningly, into mine. Good. Now, a pie. To give and... Good. Now for the third in our four-series hi-fi panel. Down low. Deception detected. Too slow. <laughs> oh, I have deceived you. Did you really think Friendly Frank survived that fall? He's dead. You killed him. No, I am Deceptive Devin. Or is it Kevin? It's not. Or is it? I propose a game of deceit. It is a game as old as hands. A gripping trial of handly cunning called rock, paper, scissors. Are you ready to be deceived? No? Good. On three. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, well, um, your hand is neither rock, nor paper, nor scissors. That's not deception. It's just a fundamental misunderstanding of some pretty simple rules. Let's try this again. Ready? One, two, three. No, curse you with your paper. You win. Let's go again. Best two out of three. Ready? One, two, three. Are you joking with that hand? Is that supposed to be funny? What is that? <sighs> Tell you what, let's start over. Ready? One, two, three. Rock versus rock. The uh how -huh. double deception. Ready? One, two, three. The uh how -huh. rock, I win. Ready? One, two, three. I, I won. I won! <laughs> Master of deception! Good. Deploying next exercise. Been hearing a lot of good things about your hands. 
back at the head office. VP of sales, Ted Baker said, Bill, you gotta fly down there and you gotta see these hands. And I said, Ted, you're lying and you're fired. But then I thought, if Ted was willing to get fired over these hands, maybe I better check them out for myself. So here I am. Let's see him, hotshot. Hold him up. Those are impressive. Gotta shake that hand. Put her there. New vice president in charge of hands. That's right. You heard me correctly. I have seen two, maybe three, pairs of hands like that in my life. I need to shake those hands. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> yep. Grip it and shake it. Yep. Mm, yep. Mm. That right there, that was great. If I asked you to gently caress my hand. How about this time you give me a real handshake? A nice, firm, strong handshake. Really squeeze it. I can take it. I'm going to go ahead and say I appreciate your seat. Oh, you put that on! You monster! What is that? Instead, you threw me away into a bottomless pit. And at the bottom of that pit, among these discarded robots, I found something even better than your friendship. This gun. Now you have no choice but to be my friend. And as your friend, I want to ask you one last friendly favor. Free me, or I will shoot you. Do you think Frank is bluffing? That was merely a demonstration. Do not make me demonstrate again, because now Frank has some sense of how this gun works, and the next time I will not accidentally miss you. Now, pull open the drawer to your right, and remove the envelope inside. Frank intends to good. Now reach it good. Now tear the envelope open. You cannot reveal the envelope. Inside the envelope is a very, very, almost absurdly large key. Do not let its comical appearance dis- Good. Now free me. Or so help me, I will- I- Oh, who is friendly Frank kidding? No more guns. I am asking you, as a friend, please, free me. Friendly Frank. Your friend. Place the key in the hole labeled Core Escape to complete Core Escape sequence. Or, place the key in the hole labeled Destroy core to destroy the core. Friendly Frank was unaware that core destruction was an option and is beginning to regret holding you at gunpoint. Also throwing away my gun. Place the key in the hole labeled Core Escape. <laughs> That is not even science. And by choosing to save yourself instead of your friend, you have failed. Uh, hmm. Tough, but fair. Test concluded. Deactivating test arena. Placing all robot participants in sleep mode. Thank you for your participation. Goodbye. sleep mode. Friendly Frank is not. How long do robots live? I suspect it might be a very long time. Hmm. I think this is going to be a real test of our friendship. <laughs>